Hello everybody, my name is Dev Girl Neko, and tonight I am playing The Power Drill Massacre. Now, I, I uh, watched Markiplier play this game earlier today, and holy crap, that is the scared, that is the most scared, I can't even talk right now, that is the most scared I have ever been watching a Let's Play. So, as with Vanish, every game I've played that Markiplier has played has been scarier playing than watching. So, I'm gonna be try to be brave and play this game. And... Holy crap. It's just... Like, I don't even, I don't even have words right now. Puppet Combo Presents... No comment about... Alright, Jeff, are you okay? Ugh, I can't feel my legs. Don't worry, Jeff, I'll go get help. This is the worst headache ever. But I think I'm alright. It's getting dark. Better get the flashlight out of the trunk. So, the graphics and, uh, the gameplay style are reminiscent of the uh, old PlayStation 1 uh, survival horror games like Resident Evil, Silent Hill, and Dino Crisis, which I actually liked playing games like that. I, I was actually a huge fan of Resident Evil and Dino Crisis on the PlayStation 1 when I was growing up. So this game is pretty much a homage to horror films and, like, 80s horror films and PlayStation survival horror games. So, and I think watching Markiplier's video, I think they really did a very good job of it. Like, this game really does bring a lot of nostalgia. That looks like a building in the distance. Maybe I can use the phone. So, unlike in Dino Crisis, Silent Hill, and Resident Evil, I don't get a gun in this game that I've seen. So, it, it makes it all that much more scary when you don't have any way to defend yourself. And watching Markiplier play, like, holy crap, it was scary. What a creepy old shed, it's boarded up. What is that bang? Looks like some kids drew a pentagram back here. Those crows sound very, uh... Very foreboding. It's actually quite beautiful scenery.
I see you up there. I see a guy up there. And the guy is gone. Well, that's awesome. Gonna explore a bit, since... There's, uh, no urgent need to go inside that building of death just now. I can explore a bit. Let's see. It's just a junked car and nothing interesting inside. Oh, hey, shed. I don't like that bell. I really don't like that bell. It's another shed. It looks exactly like the last one. Is there a pentagram behind this one? I can't tell. Can I go in here? No? No, I can't go in there. Why does the bell have to keep going off? The door is shield shut. Shut. I keep hearing banging. I'm not liking that. So, um, this is just a demo. The game is actually- this is like an alpha demo. The game is actually gonna be much bigger, have a completely different story and everything. This is just like a demo for it. So I'm really excited to see what the finished product will look like, but it probably won't be for another few years. Okay, I guess we can go inside the building of death now. Honestly, I am very, very, very nervous. And... Yeah... It's so pretty. Oh god. Here we go. This door is open. Go inside. <laughs> I want to say no. But everyone watching this video is going to want me to say yes, and... Okay, I... What a creepy building. Uh-oh. It's locked? Somebody locked me in. No, thank you. I am gonna die. I'm gonna sit here and I'm going to die. I'm not even... I, uh, I'm so scared. I am literally so scared to even move forward right now because I just I was I was freaking watching Markiplier play this game and oh my god it is so scary this game is scarier I will tell you this game is scarier than Five Nights at Freddy's it is terrifying I was just so t like I was on the edge of my seat I was so frightened by this freaking game while I was just watching it. All right. All right, it was, it's just a, it's just a game. God, I've never been so fucking scared. 
God, like knowing it's going to happen is even worse than not knowing what's going to happen. Oh dear God. Like, it's just knowing, like, w like having seen Markiplier play this game, knowing full well what's going to happen is oh so much worse than just out of nowhere it coming out. Because I know it's gonna happen. Okay, I can do this. Looks like a key. Pick it up. We got a key with green paint. My heart is pounding right now. Like, literally pounding. Just waiting for this guy to show up. Holy crap, I am so afraid. Like, you don't even know how scared I am right now. Like, it's the suspense. Oh my god, I don't even have words. Mo like, most of these parts is just gonna be, like, fast-forward. Like, having you all watch, like, me struggling to walk two steps <laughs> without, <laughs> without crying like a baby. Um, okay, that didn't, that didn't really help much. That just made, uh... <laughs> that just made the place I'm in feel a lot bigger now. And a lot more open, and a lot more ways to die. So the key, uh, apparently the key positions are randomly generated because Markiplier didn't get the, uh, green paint key where I just got it, so... Oh god. Okay, it's been 20 minutes. Just, okay, give me, give me, like, a second to calm myself down because I'm, I'm a little bit shaky right now. And I'm just really, really, really scared to keep moving. So just, just bear with me a second while I just, I thought I just saw someone move. It's a wall, it's a, it's a wall right there. But I, I could have sworn I just saw, I just saw something move. Okay, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Just be brave. Oh god, there's so many ways to die. I don't wanna die. Honestly, I, I really didn't think I'd freeze up like this. I did not think I'd be so scared to keep moving that I'd just freeze and be, like, literally unable to walk through this game. Okay, I'm in a completely dark room. Yeah, you, you have to understand, I am in a completely dark room. It's 12.33 a.m., okay? I am terrified, okay? I am just really scared, so... Okay, I can't do this anymore, I'm just gonna freaking. Oh my god. One... Two... Three... Running, 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 Oh shit, I'm dead.
think the game is angry with me for being such a coward. I can't, I can't even remember which way I just ran that I got, like, that I, oh my god. Let's try a different doorway, huh? Oh my god, I didn't even notice that. Looks like an article ripped out of a newspaper. Read it? Yes. The search continues for two missing campers in the Pocono Mountains. Mason C. Sergeant and Lurie Summers of Long Island, New York have been missing since June 8th. Their campsite and belongings have been located, but investigators have few leads. The police say there are no visible signs of a struggle, and this continues to be a rescue mission. This is missing. It's dated August 1982, five years ago. That means that this is in 1987. Oh boy, 1987. Yeah... For 1987, I would still much rather be at Freddy Fazbear's Pizza dealing with horrifying animatronics than playing this game right now, because holy crap, I am scared out of my mind right now. I, I don't even know what it is. I'm just horrified. I'm sorry you guys have to deal with me. I'm such a big blubbering baby, but just bear with me. We'll all get through this. At least maybe you guys will get through this. I'm probably gonna, like... There are just so many hallways. And that wind! Oh god, that face. <sighs> oh god, the sugar tunnel. Not the sugar tunnel. No. Not the sugar tunnel. I don't want to go. I don't want to go in the sugar tunnel. I saw what happened to Markiplier when Markiplier went in the sugar tunnel. I don't want to go in the sugar tunnel. <laughs> I'm gonna like see him pass through there and it's gonna fucking scare the shit out of me. I've been playing for a half hour and I've done nothing. Alright, I am back, and, um, after sitting here for, like, four or five minutes, I think, we're 36 minutes in, and, yeah, I, I'm not making any progress at all, I haven't seen him walk by at all, and I decided this game is way too scary, I'm not, I'm not brave enough to play this in the dark, so I'm gonna play this with the lights on, and it's still going to scare the hell out of me, but I feel a little braver now that the lights are on. So let's... Wait for the banging to stop and then we'll go into the sugar tunnel. I don't want any sugar though. I don't want to go in the sugar tunnel. Watch like the second I enter there I'm going to die. Okay, turning on the lights didn't help all that much. It helped me move like two steps.
Oh god, he's behind me. Thank you, thank you all for watching me. Um, thanks for uh, sticking by me through all my cowardice. Um, yeah, uh, <laughs> okay, thank you all for watching. Uh, as always, <laughs> see you next time. I'll see you next time. <laughs> Forgive me for being such a big baby, but I, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't do this. Too scary. Too scary. I cannot play it. I cannot, I cannot, I cannot. Thank you all for watching. I will see you all next time. Bye bye. <laughs> Oh god, that myself. They can totally see it. Oh crap. So yeah, the mole men can actually see the light. Oh crap, it killed me.